Hello friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and in this tutorial I will show you how you can create a macro for firstly creating a new cat part file and then saving it in a particular location. So as you can see here, once you run the macro, the final result you get is uh, a cat part file will be open in the kitiavi 5 and then the file, the same file will be saved in a particular folder that we desire. So firstly, I will delete this before I run the macro and I will just show you by running the macro now. So just note that it's deleted and once I run the macro, the catpad file is open and the file is saved here. So as you can see, the time is 10.27, that's the time here. So let's just get started how you can do this so I'll delete this once again because I'm going to use the same uh, folder name or the folder path for the uh, tutorial which I'm going to show you here so firstly go to tools macro and macros and firstly go to create msvba and you need to um, learning to something like that you just have to recognize it so double click and start the macro the first thing you need to do is dim new doc as document now set new doc equal to ketia dot documents dot add then comes the part so a part will be added now a new part will be added so if you just want to have a look at it so just play the macro and you can see the new part is added just close it and come back to the macro now you need to dim again and save doc this time as document and then set save doc equals ketia dot active document now that save doc becomes the active document and now mm, save doc dot save as then you can give a space and then you can enter the location where you want to save that so just give this the location and this time just give new test whatever file name you want and give the extension properly close and now if you just press on the play button And if you see here new test so that was a very simple macro which explained you some important things for you to start with the macros so I hope you enjoyed the tutorial and if you have any doubt on this you can comment below the video and I'll be getting in touch with you thank you so much for watching and stay tuned for more tutorials and don't forget to subscribe